Amen. Well, praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord. This is me, Apostle Esther. I want to thank you for joining me for my YouTube channel on today. We are always super excited to share in the gospel of the Lord Jesus Christ. I am going to give you a moment to get your notepads, your iPads, your Bibles, um, your device, um, so that you can follow along in the word of the Lord. Uh, so I'm going to give you a moment. I'm going to hang out right here, review my notes, and we're going to go right into the word of the Lord. God bless you. Amen. So we are right back. We want to look at Deuteronomy chapter 8, verse 3. And the Bible says, And he humbled thee, and suffered thee to hunger, and fed thee with manna, which thou knewest not. Neither did thy fathers know that he might make thee know that man doth not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceedeth out of the mouth of the Lord doth man live. So here the writer is saying that man does not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. And if we were to flip over to Matthew chapter 4 and verse 4, it would say the same thing, that man does not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. And we see that in Matthew, the Lord was speaking this word to Satan as he was at the pivotal and um, I often say the pinnacle of a testing time in his life. And Satan wanted to use uh, every trick uh, to get Jesus to bend and bow to his, tr um, to his trickeries. But the Bible says that God, Jesus gave Satan the word of God, the word of, of his father. He said, man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. So what am I saying today? When we're being tested um, at heights and peaks and pivotals and pinnacles in our lives, we need to apply the word of God back to the enemy and say that man does not live by bread alone, but uh, he lives by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. God is speaking his word to us. Are we listening? Are we hearing? Are, are we obeying what the Lord is speaking to us? Man does not live by bread alone, but we do live by every word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. Then the Bible says he gives us daily our bread. So he gives us fresh word, fresh bread, fresh nutrients of his word every day. I want to encourage you on today that whatever you're going through, whatever you're dealing with, remember man does not live by bread alone, but we do live by the preceding word of God, the authority of God's word that answers every problem, every concern that we face and we encounter in life. I am Apostle Esther. I am simply an ambassador of the Lord Jesus Christ. Super excited about the assignment that the Lord has me on. I thank you in advance for sharing, liking, and if you so desire, please subscribe to my channel. And remember, we come your way every day, Monday through Friday at 10 a.m. Have an amazing day. God bless you.